high contrast <laughs> mode. Oh God, yes. we're, we're we're keeping it. Hey, how's it going? Uh, this is Nick. Oh, are we recording? <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a high class production this is. I got Swarly here. This is uh, this is Let's Play Two, um, episode twenty nine of WWF. Going hot. Uh oh. Hmm. Botany, botany, botany. Took him under his wing. <laughs> Making Mike Miraldo the next Bob Backlund. I feel like Bob could have chosen picked someone better. Yeah. yeah, Rob Van Dam, maybe. I mean, if if Rob, that Bob Backlund and Rob Van Dam would never get along in a million years. But if he did, I would have changed him to Bob Van Dam to honor his mentor. Mm. Mm. Dodge a bullet on that one. So you want to book Bob Van Dam or no? Uh, I mean, we always book one superstars, right? That's yeah, yeah, that's, thing. yeah. Yeah. Uh, might as well start there. Uh, you want to do like a New japan style of booking? Where we just kind of throw two feuds together? Call it, sure. call it a tag match? Sure. So, it would be the um, vampires mm -hmm. and the fire guy. Mm-hmm. Versus the Native American and those young wrestler types. Okay, whatever. Yep. I mean, yeah. It's a match. It's superstars. Yeah. That would be the main event, though. I don't think this is going to be the main event. I mean, it's superstars, it doesn't matter, but... Uh, All right, we'll see. Well, I mean, it's not going to be a main event. Or yeah, that's event. why. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like, I know Vampiro and uh, Black Phantom aren't great. We'll put it that way. Yeah, they've been not doing well. But there's history in this match between Tatanka and the vampires. You may you may remember Tatanka in the woods. I do. Yes. Tatanka's, Tatanka's getting the win. Okay. I'm fine with this. Okay. That's That was it. That's all I got. Okay. Um... Well, let's book Rob Van Dam. <laughs> I mean, let's start with what we know. Yep. Probably book a... Um, I would actually like to see a Johnny Polo solo match. Johnny Polo solo. Okay. So, not not here, but... Not here. No. Let's, let's give him a, a mid-card and go over. Pierre? You know, this Rick is going to... This is going to play into something we're going to do later. Let's have him beat Quang. Okay. I mean, he's going to change his gimmick then, I think. Don't, don't, don't fucking... No, I'm saying I think we already set that up. Oh. My dude. Well, then let's not do this. <laughs> let, me, let me see. Okay. Uh, I think we're all set. I think we're good. So he could beat Quang. Uh, I don't know. Did we set it up? Do you remember? I I don't know. Can we? Let's. let's we did not. We did not set it All up. All right, we're good. We're good. Guys, this is ignore very ignore everything you just heard. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing is happening with Quang. No. no. We have no plan for Quang. Quang who? What's a Quang? Don't even. Never heard of him, bro. Rob's winning. God damn it. I don't even care. Shut up, Quang. I I mean, I we're doing things. We like yep. him being unhappy might be a problem. No, I'll throw him some cash. Okay. All right. Uh, let's let's book some things that people won't hate. Uh. All right. I know how to start that. All right. So, um, things that people won't hate. <laughs> Got it. All right. Nailed it. Not uh, not okay. Got it. All right. What you, what do you got? I don't know. I was thinking maybe like a like a promo. Uh, maybe like a anyone promo. Well, first, you need to start the show off with a video package. That's true. And what better video package than two big dogs? <laughs> yeah. 
recapping their feud, which has so far been like them talking, a challenge, and then talking at each other. Yeah, and like not even really getting heated, just being like, "I'm the big dog around here." No, yeah. I'm the big dog around here. Yeah, yeah, this sounds good. Um, uh, Razor Ramon should cut a promo on Jeff Jarrett, or vice versa. Does how, how about both? <laughs> okay. Razor on Jeff, and then later in the night, Jeff retaliates with a scathing promo of his own. I'm fine with this. Yep. Tune in later to hear Jeff Jarrett's uh, rebuttal to the words that Razor said, which is probably like, I'm the bad guy, I'm going to win. I don't know. I don't know what a Razor Ramon promo sounds like anymore. I think uh, Vader hot off his uh, attack of Bret Hart and then his recreational drug use should uh, just brag about how he laid out the champ and how and then, he's uh, guaranteed to win the title at in your haunted house. Yep, and then how he went and smoked later. <laughs> Celebrated his yes. moral victory. Celebrated real hard. Yeah. And I think he should do that right after the Rob Van Dam match. I think that should close the show. Oh. Well, then it should probably be more than three minutes. All right. That's a six minutes is a long Vader promo. Well, you know. Um. So. Here's here's. <coughs> oh goodness, I'm getting all choked up thinking about this promo. Oh God. No, it's nothing crazy. No, really. <laughs> it isn't. I mean, anytime I see you in the editor, I'm just like, here we go. No, it's just, it's it's Owen. Okay. Owen Hart is backstage looking for his... Who, who's our president? Tony still? Gorilla Monsoon. Gorilla. But cannot find him. He asks some other workers where Gorilla is, but they don't know. Where's Gorilla, Swirly? No I, one. I don't know. No one knows. Am I the person he's asking? Because I, I, I mean that'd be roster, I guess. that'd be great, but yeah. No, I mean the only overness here is Owen, and then you could have a bunch of like, I don't know, four people he goes up to, and he's like, "Have you seen him?" This is a great segment. PJ Walker, have you seen Gorilla? <laughs> I need to ask for my Owen wins match against Davey. I, yeah, I think this is where we put all our road agents in. Eh, I was thinking like lower, like shit, like level guy like uh, Matt Hardy. Nah, it's Sergeant Slaughter. Get him in there. Sure. I don't think I could put him on the show though. Oh, that sucks. Yeah. Well, fine then. Fucking Mike Morrell though. Yeah. Where's Gorilla? Vince. Vince, have you seen Gorilla? I need to talk to the person in charge. Uh, Owen. Jobber 1. Jobber 2. Jobber 3. And Jobber 4. See, I told you it wasn't too crazy. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty, pretty underwhelming, if it's going to be honest. Yeah. It's it's a slow build. It's going somewhere. It's not it's not going somewhere. Uh you're not you're not low enough on the card for these Jabrones. You need like enhancement talent. Swarley? Yes. Lord Alfred Hayes. <laughs> I mean and Alpha were All just right. hanging out. And also, uh, who else? And also Vince. You four were just having a conversation. That sounds like a good time. And not off of Owen Hart just runs up and is like, Hey, have any of you guys seen Gorilla? You know, yay high, bald, wears glasses. Uh, never heard of him. Yeah. He starts pitching a match to, to you guys. And you guys are like, look, you need to talk to Gorilla. None of us are in charge. Yeah, none of us have the book. Yeah, Vince is like, yeah, I can't make man. You're, you're like, no, I can't. Yeah, it's it's a real meta. 
Yeah. There you go. Owen looking for Gorilla. That's genius, bro. Trying to set up some match. That's real. That's real right yeah, there. Yeah, people, will, they're not going to look away from their TVs. Uh, uh, I think one three kids should win a match. Oh. Maybe he needs to build up some momentum. Oh. Yeah. Although he's actually doing better than I thought he would on momentum. Yeah, but he can still get a win. Oh, yeah, of course. I mean, Rick Martel's not doing anything. There you go, buddy. Have we done this? Yeah, I got a 50. Yeah, yeah let's, put, let's not put Rick Martel. I mean, it doesn't matter who we put here. But I mean, it doesn't, but I I still would rather just not book Frick Martel. Uh, we got in the mid card. Frick Martel? Why do they have decent... I don't know. Maybe Timothy Well wants to lose to one to three kids. I sure. Or Stephen Dunn. It doesn't yeah, matter. yeah, I mean, whatever. Maybe Well this week and then Dunn next week and then uh, one two three kid beats them both in a handicap match. Yeah, that sounds great. Yeah. I mean, that's not going to happen, but... No, that would be... Yeah. <laughs> All right. I think that's the show. All right. I will... I didn't get my Johnny Polo solo, but... Oh, that's... all right. We... we I mean... Uh, yeah, sure. Why not? We'll get him in there. We can get him in quick. Oh, he's he he is a heel. Hey, let's add a bomb, whatever. We're not doing anything with Adam Bomb, right? Nope. Okay. Now we got cut two minutes. Need to make it a little a little quicker, you two. Alright, you ready, Swarley? Sure. Let's start. I'm always ready. Yeah, let's do some big dog. Hoorah, hoorah, hoorah. There you go. 75. That might be our... Well, no. We got Razor and Jared Promos. I should beat that. Oh, yep. I don't know. It might be big dogs. <laughs> big, big dogs. dogs. might be the top. Uh. Ah, okay. Yeah, right. Mid-card. Even Flow DDT, of course. Yeah, Johnny Polo with the Even Flow DDT. I don't even think that song came out yet. Hmm. Yeah, I don't. Ooh. 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 They didn't click. They didn't click. Oh, okay. They didn't, okay. We're, we're okay. Timothy Wells, they were, they're not good for anything. <laughs> Fuck off. God damn it. Oh, Lee Bryan busted out the choke slam. Yep. Lee Bryan, you seem to be better versus Davy Boy Smith than Barry Horowitz. Weird. Jeff Jarrett, reminding people that he has, in fact, beaten Randy Savage. Now he's gonna beat Razor. And now he's gonna beat Razor Ramon. What did the, what did we do with them at the last pay per view? We did like a Schmaz finish, right? Yeah, I think so. I think so. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, that was okay. I don't know if I would bust out the Van Terminator on, <laughs> <laughs> on Look, superstars. Man, he's trying to make an impression. He's trying to make a name for himself here in the world. Sure. <laughs> that I mean, that is one way to make a name for yourself. Oh yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Congratulations, Swarley. You were in the <laughs> promo of the night. Yes. People love Owen Hart. Yeah. Never underestimate how much they love Owen Hart. I did a real good job just being like, I don't know. I haven't seen him. <laughs> <laughs> what a main event we have here on Superstars. Uh, stay tuned for this match. <laughs> oh, right. The Dark Society. Right. Tatanka and the Thrill Seekers versus Bam Bam and the Dark Society. Yep. Yeah. Ooh, that came close. Vito. I mean, that would have been good if Owen was an OP. Yeah. Hmm. Good job, Vader. Good job, Owen. That was a superstars. Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope Owen can someday find Gorilla Monsoon. Thanks for watching.